All right, guys, here's the latest news. Uh, Israel is talking about attacking Iran by December of this year. And I also want to thank this channel, PUR303END. Um, he sent me this story, and also, you know, my mom sent me the story. A bunch of you guys have been sending me the story. Hey, Shock, have you heard about Israel may possibly attack Iran's nuclear facilities? And one of the things that we know about Netanyahu is he is very bold when it comes to his position on defending Israel. Click more info and read this story. And before I tell you a little bit about this story, from a Christian perspective, one of the things that boggles my mind is how the Bible actually says that Israel are God's chosen people. And as Christians, we respect that. I do. The Bible says, whoever shall bless Israel shall be blessed. Whoever shall curse Israel shall be cursed. And sometimes I'll see people, they're saying they're Christians and they're talking bad about Israel. You guys, listen, you're out of line. You need to get back in line and support God's position on Israel. They are his chosen people. And I say, God bless Israel. Um, I personally don't want to be friends with people that uh, are cursing Israel and are against Israel. I, I really don't care to be friends with them. Our Christian perspective should be what God says about Israel, and they are his chosen people. Uh, another thing also, biblically, a lot of scholars say that Russia will actually invade Israel. They'll uh, uh, try to invade Israel. And... Um, I was thinking, now why would Russia just up and invade Israel? Think about that. Well, it is no secret that Russia and Iran are allies. What if Israel attacked Iran by December and Iran and Russia got together and tried to invade Israel? I could see that happening. Uh, because obviously if Israel attacks Iran, uh, Iran will look at it as an act of war. Because we got Adema Dodo here the complete nutcase that says the Holocaust never happened. So I support Israel. I do hope they attack uh, by December and take out the uh, nuclear threat. Um, so go ahead and click more info. Read this story. Make sure you are rooted and grounded in the word. If you're a Christian, remember God's command to us is Israel are his chosen people. Whoever blesses the Jews shall be blessed. Whoever curses Israel shall be cursed. And so I say, as a true Christian, God bless Israel. And we got Adima Dodo here, and we got Netanyahu here, and it is phenomenal what is happening in the Middle East. It's exciting also at the same time, but what the problem that people are terrified is if Iran gets nuclear weapons, like what it says right here, it says then Saudi Arabia, Egypt, uh, they'll want to obtain nuclear weapons, bringing about a Middle East look fully loaded with nuclear weapons. Just where we don't want nuclear weapons over there in the Middle East, it's like the Hatfield and McCoys over there. Click share below this video. Send it to everybody. These are exciting times. They're dangerous times. Um, the, this could be the beginning of the birth pangs that Christ talked about. Read the full story on the top right here. Click more info and you could read the actual story.